Rare response to Andy Boosman Quality versus Quantity Enjoy Hello Hello This is a video response to Andy Boosman And Gary I suppose In a way Illustrating what quality uh, Or quantity And two of my favourite series of films and books First of all Harry Potter series starts off Nice small book, first book, a couple of pages, 200, 223 pages, fine. Second book, Chamber of Secrets, once again, reasonably short, 250 pages, that's fine. Now, this is where the, pro this is where the problem starts, into book three. Book three is still pretty reasonable, it's 317 pages long. And here you go, Harry Potter and the Prison of Excaban. Now, here's where the fun starts. Goblet of Fire. These are all great books, by the way. And says love, and so do I. We're talking 636 pages all of a sudden. 636. Pretty big? Yeah. Pretty big book, yes. And now we're on to book five. Hardback version this time. Oh, this is massive. This is heavy. This is 763 pages long. Which amazes me how the kids could read these so fast. And book number six. 607 pages long. Harry Potter and the Half Blood Prince. And the one I'm reading at the moment, and the one I'm reading at the moment, the final book, Harry Potter and the Deadly Hallows, it's 605 pages long. Now, tell me how kids can read those in one day, when they get them, tell me how they can read them so quickly. Now, my favourite film of all... Of course, the Harry Potter series has been turned into a film, and I have all those on DVD too. And there we go, first film, best film in my opinion, Harry Potter and the Philosopher's Stone, then we have Chamber of Secrets, good film as well, change the director then, Harry Potter and the Prison of Escadan, and The Goblet of Fire. I've not yet seen the new. I've not yet seen the new film in the cinema. I wait for it to come out on DVD. And some say the book. Well, the books have a lot more detail than the movies. And some people have watched the movies without reading the books. And the first movie that got me to read. Start reading the books about five years ago. And taking my time with the last book. I'm looking forward to J.K. Rowling's next excursion. All time, Lord of the Rings. Let me first start off with the books. These are the books of the series. And the books have a lot more, and in fact are better than the films. They're fairly big books as well. Takes a couple of <coughs> months to get through that lot. And, of course, as a fan, I've seen the films in the cinema. And these are the theatrical versions of the films. The Return of the King, that's the last book, it's the last film. Fellowship of the Ring, the first book, the best in my opinion. Two Towers, this was the theatrical version was too short because this book has this book is the this book is the smallest book. In the series and they sadly mixed up all the books into the three films. I hardly watched these, keep them for my collection. And as Gary had, I also have the extended versions of those movies, which I think are absolutely brilliant. And never watched the theatrical version, which I have the extended version. And these are absolutely wonderful books, wonderful DVDs. Loads of other extras on them. Much better than the original discs. And I would watch Lord of the Rings for four days. Four hours long, as Gary said. Yes. 
and it's a lot slower and does show a lot more from the books than the theatrical versions which are excellent as well so basically what I'm saying if something is good it can be as long as it wants regardless of the length once it's good quality as I said yesterday as I said I'm a comment to Andy take the Jim Abraham films the Nick Gun a Airplane and the like they are short less than 90 minutes each but reason being they're rewatchable loads and loads of times regardless how many times you've seen them I watch other comedies longer and I've only watched them once I bought the DVDs and only watched them once basically because the heart's going and which you see there's really no point in watching it again that's my rant at just five minutes and quality quantity quality wins over the for me except for the Lord of the Rings and Harry Potter Thanks for subscribing. Please subscribe to Andy Mooseman and join the vloggerhood today.